Steve Bell, heavy reading, reporting for theconnectedcar.com at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas 2018. Yesterday, the Consumer Technology Association shared with us the trends that they are anticipating being throughout the CES this, this week. Primarily, artificial intelligence, 5G, and smart cities linked through the autonomous vehicle. The North Hall of the Las Vegas Convention Center is like Detroit. There's more cars in there than there are on the Strip. The interesting aspect is what is this artificial intelligence going to be doing? So part of that is the voice agents, so the Alexas, the Google, in the vehicle, enabling consumers to seamlessly move from their home into the vehicle and into the, the workplace, controlling their environment with their voice. It's the biggest single change and it's the fastest growing change that the industry has seen, far faster than tablets or smartphones. And it's the interesting area that most people are talking about and certainly a lot of the startups are working on. In addition, you've got mirrors, mirrors in the vehicle with cameras that do facial recognition for the uh, driver. And why is that important? It means that you can have security. The car won't start unless it's a driver that's identified. Security in terms of your garage door, home link won't operate unless it's you. And equally, from an OEM perspective and ride share, it means that cars can be tailored to the people that are walking into those cars. So you can have a profile online, the face recognition sees you and changes the profile in the car. Now all of this is driven by GPUs, which is generated by a company called NVIDIA. Because of GPU computing, we're able to synthesize virtual reality. NVIDIA had a huge press conference yesterday. They were talking about the system on a chip. They basically taken servers and put it onto a single chip with nine billion transistors. This week is gonna be all about the automation, artificial intelligence, 5G, and autonomous vehicles and smart cities. It's going to be a very interesting week.